Now it's time for to use up the scraps of marble or glaze paper to make this colourful tea time mosaic. The teapot and the mug are both made, uh, designed to have lots of little scraps of paper to make them look beautiful. The handles have been coloured in though so that the child doesn't have a hard time tearing the paper very small to accommodate them the handles. This is what you get. Do tell the children that these lines are not for cutting. In fact, they don't need a pair of scissors at all. We go over the dotted lines with a crayon. All the dotted lines are to be traced over. It gives the children wonderful eye-hand coordination and also muscle control. I'm doing just this one to illustrate. There's some steam coming out of the cup of the mug and I'm tracing over that as well and the handle. Now I'm colouring, I'm going to colour the handle in whatever colour I like. I like blue, I'm colouring it blue. And then again, using Fevy stick, I, and all those tiny bits of paper, I tear them up. Don't cut. Tear and stick to give you this lovely effect. You can either put the fevi, uh, rub the fevi stick on the mug itself or on the pieces. I'm rubbing it on the pieces here and sticking it. That's how I proceed. It takes a little while. Don't make the children tear these too small because they will get bored and fed up. I'm trying to do that. Teach them to alternate the colors. You just have to tear those off and stick them. And so on. So till the whole mug is completed and also the teapot until at last it's a wonderfully colorful teapot.